History has been made at the famed Paris Opera Ballet Company. For the first time in more than three and a half centuries, a black ballet artist has been elevated to the highest rank of star dancer. ABC's Inez de la Catera spoke to the young star about his incredible achievement. incredible to me like to be uh, at this place at this age and to carry like this weight. Guillaume Jeb's artistry on stage is magical, powerful, majestic. This past March, the 23-year-old was elevated to the highest possible rank within France's prestigious Paris Opera Ballet Company, becoming the first black danseur étoile or star dancer in the company's 354-year history. Founded in 1669, the Paris Opera Ballet is the world's oldest national ballet company. Home to greats such as Sylvie Guillem, Sayoun Park, the first Asian star ballerina, Mathieu Guignot, and of course, the legendary Rudolf Nureyev, its most notable director and chief choreographer. Diop, born in Paris to a French mother and Senegalese father, began dancing at four years old. At 12, he enrolled in the Paris Opera's ballet school program, which creates a path for dancers with immense potential to become an official dance company member. I loved ballet because it's very strict, very, very clear. But I really like to find how to express my emotion and how to be myself in such a very um, strict style of dancing. So that's. That's my thing. At 16, enamored with the beauty and discipline of dance, Diop studied at the famed Alvin Ailey Dance Theater, an experience he says filled him with the confidence to forge ahead. It just felt good to be in a place where there's a lot of people that look like me, that are great dancers with like very different bodies and, and style. Yeah, it was, it was comforting for me. So when you were at Alvin Ailey, you said this teacher told you that your blackness was your strength. I asked her if she thought that I could be like a dancer, like a danseur étoile in Paris Opera. And she told me that of course I could because like my blackness and was something unique and I had to use uh, this like difference to be a better dancer. And During our interview, we surprised Guillaume with a FaceTime call from that very Alvin Ailey teacher. We have a surprise for you, Guillaume. We reached out to Graziella. Oh my God. <laughs> I am so proud of you because when I saw you being nominated as a dancer, dancer at all, I started crying. I was in the subway. Your light will carry a lot of people because a lot of dancers are going to look up to you. Like many artists, prompted by the global outrage over George Floyd's death at the hands of police in 2020, Diop became an activist. He, along with four other Paris Opera ballet dancers, seen here on the cover of France's Le Monde magazine, wrote a manifesto, shining a spotlight on what they considered discrimination and lack of diversity. Yeah, we were asking like for uh, proper makeup, uh, pro uh, hair products that were actually good for us. Uh, the thighs for the ladies uh, to um, to stop doing blackface, uh, to um, and just to start thinking about how can we make uh, Paris Opera a safer place. The Paris Opera Ballet published a diversity report and took action on several of their basic demands. As the saying goes, heavy is the crown for the newly appointed star dancer. And now you get to be a role model for so many little boys and girls. What's that like for you? It's amazing. It's a lot of weight and pressure, but I feel like it's a beautiful weight. I know that it's so important and I'm very happy and uh, grateful to be able to be that for other people. Oh, the story makes me so proud, and not just proud of him for all that he's accomplished, but his parents mm -hmm. for supporting him at a young age, four years old. Yeah, and proud of the work he's doing for the next generation. Mm -hmm. Love it, love it, love it. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.